All right. Um, thank you, Ashiwaju Dokas, for the invite. And I'm talking on behalf of IIM Dimensional Class. So it is a pleasure to be sharing this message with you now. And sorry for the abrupt end of that particular video. As I was talking, there were calls coming in and um, the all of that. So, and the location I was, the network there isn't good. So, from what I was saying, it is very important that you discover the pros and cons of how to make impact, influence, and income from public speaking. Because the, the, the juicy part of this is that if you are not keen into your impact, your influence, and income, you may find it difficult to move on. I'm telling you the, the, the blatant truth here. If you are not making impact, if you are not making influence, or you are not making income, let me tell you, you should fizzle out. You get frustrated. So it is better for you now to set the systems right. It's better for you now to position yourself right so that you can get the whole thing there. So what is all of these things about? How can you get it done? The very first step, like I shared earlier, is that you have to hone a message. When you hold a message, you have to know who the message is meant for. When you know who the message is meant for, you also need to know how to pass the message across to them. This is where persuasion comes in. Now, in persuasion, you have to understand how to make your point in a logical manner such that the recipient of those points or those messages would be able to perfectly understand what you are saying and will be convinced to doing business with you. Let me tell you the truth here. The truth is, public speaking is not a destination. It is only a means to an end. It is only a medium to achieve something. So, public speaking is just there to serve as a means by which you reach out to the world. For example, now, gracefully, I am a ghostwriter and a publisher. And I've written books for over 300 people. Yes. So, one thing that is there is that I cannot become a public speaker. I can become a public speaker now. Talking about what ghost writing and publishing or goal setting because those are my fields. I'm not saying I'm the boss of public speaking. What I'm doing is what I am using public speaking as a medium to reach out to my audience, as a medium to reach out to those I'm targeting. That should be the same for you too. There must be something you are doing that only public speaking you can use public speaking as one of the medium to pass a message across. Now I have a lot of messages. I can pass it across via book writing. I can pass it across via online course. I can pass it across via um, audio. I can pass it across via videos. Tell them what you are doing, what you are watching now. And I can also pass it across via live event. Those are medium. Public speaking is not the destination. It is only a road to the destination. That is one thing you should have. So have something working for you first before you can be regarded. Because if people do not know you for something, they will not invite you to come and speak. But when they are sure that you can deliver on a particular thing or a particular tax or a particular project, then they will be sure that they will be glad to open up their doors to you so that you can come ahead to share whatever thing you have to share with them. So have something working. Go and become a master at something. Be it um, ghost writing just like I'm doing. Be it on talent. Be it go and be a master at something. Find what you are naturally best at. Put your best to it once you are the best at it. I come again. Find what you are naturally blessed at. Put your best to it until you are the best at it. When you are able to do these three things well, then people will now start calling you because you make money in public speaking via two ways. Invited. If they don't invite you, invite yourself. Inviting yourself simply means you are selling your product or services. You understand? Or they invite you for a program, then you are also selling to them. And when you are sure of your message and you have been invited, understand this that your money comes from your products or services. And how can you convert those you are talking to to become your client or, to your, or your customers? It depends on how persuasive you are, on how you can convince them to do business with you. It's not about shouting, come and buy, come and buy, or you are selling. What matters is sell without selling. And how do you do that? It is by you portraying yourself as an expert, as a, an authority in a particular field. That is just a simple way. Then have an online presence. It's very important. 
before you can get the I I I very well. Have an online presence. How visible are you online on the social media platforms? How visible are you offline? It's very important. You have to create your balance between all of these two things. Imagine if they were not like online again. Tell me, where will you be? Will you be found again? Ask yourself that same question so that you can get the very best results for yourself. Then the very last thing I'm going to be sharing here is this. Understand your market. This is not understand your customer. Understand your market. Understand your market simply means creating what your market wants, not what they need. Everybody needs to sleep, but not everybody wants to sleep, right? You get that? So understand what they want from what they need. Create something in regard to what they want, not what they need. See, stop this habit of, uh, it's my passion, it's my passion. I want to make money from this passion. No, 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 but, ah, it's my passion. No, no, I want to make money from this. Hey, stop it. Make the money to fund your dreams. Everybody has something they are passionate about for. But create something legitimately. Invest in something to get money so you can pursue your passion. That way, when you have reason, people will not start inviting you. Ah, let us invite Akolade <laughs> Let us invite uh, Ashwadio Dakas. Let us invite this. You know, they will start inviting you to come and share your experiences. Nobody will ever call a failure that has not become a success to come share your experience. Think about that. It's common sense. So I believe with all of this that I've shared with you now, you should be able to rise, have an online presence, know your market, know your audience, have a message, be well grounded, be well grounded, it's very important, be well grounded. And um, I do hope you make use of all of this that I've shared, and I look forward to being part of your story. When you'll be sharing that story, chat testimony, and you tag me to remain. I love this moment. Thank you very much for listening. God bless you, I you for setting this up. You are a star. You will never stop shining.